This is going to be a quick and easy one. How to make cauliflower edible. Let's get to it. All right, first step, cut the cauliflower. You can just rip off the leaves if they come off these easily. And then with a little paring knife, just start chopping off the florets. Also throw in the trimmed down stalks. If the pieces are too big, just uh, cut them in half or in quarters. With your hand or with a knife, whichever gets the job done. While well, the water is at a rolling boil, you want to dump in the cauliflower, just like that. Let that boil for 10 minutes. Next step, you want to drain them. And you want to put them back into a pot. I downgraded the size of this pot. You want to give them a little mash with this. Add butter. Salt, pepper, white or black. I'm going to also add the garlic. Notice I have cilantro chopped up. If you don't like cilantro, use parsley or any other fresh herb you have. Dump the garlic in there. The fresh herb you want to save until the end, after the puree. Now add a bit of heavy cream, as much as it needs. About three, four tablespoons. Oh. And you can add any number of herbs and spices that you like, some oregano, some thyme, a little bit of uh, turmeric if you want to add color. And you want, you want to take this device to it. Gives you a more finer puree. If it's too dry, add more heavy cream. Or you can add chicken stock. And then now at the very end, I'm going to add the cilantro or whichever fresh herb you decided on. Mix that in there. So I decided it needs a little color contrast, so I add some red bell pepper. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. I hate cauliflower! What the hell? What, what are you doing? Stop, it's good! Jesus. I hope you all enjoyed that video. Tonight I'm going to finish up with the Ballantines 21 year old and the Monte Cristo white series. Keep cooking until next time.